Yeah. Unexpurgated. Yeah. All right. Past, future, and present. <laughs> right? Yeah. Multiple yeah. Generations. Multiple. Generations. It's everybody's here. Everybody's here. Yeah. yeah. About half of us. Rad, rad. All right. It's the reunion in Bakersfield. Bad, bad. Family first. Reunion. First show of the tour, XBXRX, crazy. That was so like that was that was intense. I don't know. I had a really good time. So what's up? It's the first show of the tour. How are you guys feeling about it? Um, pretty good. Um, <laughs> Mike, Michael commented earlier that he felt we weren't even on tour yet, and I agree with that. It feels like we're not even on tour yet. <laughs> it feels like we're not on tour yet. When's the tour gonna kick in then? I want to know. We we gotta know. I don't know after we. Slept on a lot of floors and uh, <laughs> get real smelly, then we'll know. We'll know. Yeah. We're halfway there. Halfway well, there. Weasel uses a, a towel for a blanket. He's a toy. OG. I'm hardcore. Bad. It's a long story, but yeah, basically. <laughs> tell it, tell it. What is it? Well, we were, in, we were in New York, and we were staying with our friend Ian from Japanther. My name is Ian Bannock from Japanther, and you're watching my gaze. And uh, he's got a great apartment in Brooklyn, and we usually crash there. And needless to say, we were once again crashing on his floor and now you have to understand I'm 10 years the senior of probably anyone in this band or watching this show but uh, but but you know it was a little cold I'm, I'm 83 years old but it was a pretty late at night and uh, you know there was no blanket so I just grabbed my towel and I put it on and it was pretty much just over my face and torso right so in the morning we hear Ian come in from his hot date and he goes rrr, 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 and he goes to the next room so we all ignore him and go back to sleep and uh, Later on, Vice comes over and he's like, did you hear Ian this morning? And I was like, no. And he's like, he comes in and he looks at us and he goes, man, Weasel, look at him. He's sleeping with a towel. He's no G. Yeah, and he yeah, goes, no, first he was like, look at these little cuties, man. Look at Weasel. He's got a towel for a blanket. He's OG. <laughs> so good. Yeah, we call him Sergeant then, Vanek because he's he, like, he was like man, man. And then he was like bragging his friend like, yeah, they'll sleep all day if you let him, man. Like, yeah, he just, he just kind of shook his head and approved yeah. and like walked out. Yeah, and, and, well, well, then, well, then I, I like, kind of opened up my eyes because someone was above me and he was holding these blankets and putting them over Weasel like, like you know. Mom. You know you're on tour when you're 35 and you're sleeping on floors with a towel. That is the answer. <laughs> Okay, that's when it's gonna start. All right, all right, yeah. cool, cool. Okay, the new album's out. Let's hear about the, what's what is it? What wars? Um, we uh, the most we think the most uh, dynamic dynamic record that we've done. The most thought out. Bad. Um, most intense. Most intense. So we ended up using a lot of uh, like different methods and techniques we hadn't used. We we're really interested in like getting rid of like, you know, we're like, what have we done that we really can't top it and you know we're kind of you know who's disinterested in what and so we started getting into like trying to make the guitar sound less like a guitar and um no i was like i'm sick of screaming like i don't really like i started to feel weird being on a stage and just like screaming at like people every night like <laughs> it, after a while it just psychologically it's just like oh this doesn't really feel that great and you know and and uh you know we're, we're trying to think of, you know, like get rid of like blast beats and stuff and try okay. to incorporate other ideas that we hadn't really Wait, gotten into. Get rid of blast beats. Why? Uh, um, you know, blast beats? Yeah, yeah, but why would you do, why would you want to do like, that? Well, because six and sixes is basically like a, it, we, one blast it's, beat. it's basically blast beats, feedback, and screaming. And we were like, well, we did that one. Like, yeah, we sure did. Yeah. I, I think the, the high point of our blast beat and screaming was the Narnak 7 inch, definitely. Yeah. But it's not that we're trying to, we're not trying to mellow out or anything. We're just, we're just trying to uh, do intensity in as many different ways as possible. And to us, like, we just don't want to like keep repeating ourselves so i mean you know there's different ways to uh convey intensity and that's all we're trying to do so i like it i like it cool well there's everybody here there's old members there's new old members yeah. so let's go around let's, let's, let's well introduce yourselves i'm uh i'm i'm vice i have always been in the band and a oh, what the fuck? <laughs> and, and i i have always there's a guy stuck in the door <laughs> You kind of got to get, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I, I've always been in the band. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I'm Clark, and I was in the band from 98 to 2001, 2007 until present. <laughs> the drummer. I'm back. 2007 to 2000. I was in the band in the beginning for like a year or so. 98. Right. And it was Bass fun. Yeah. Woo, woo. I'm Weasel. I was, i been in the band since uh, 2003, and I've switched instruments once. Feels good. I'm Steve, and I've been dealing with it for 
forever, basically. He started it all. Yeah. The name. Let's talk about the XBXRX. Come on. I, no, let's do it. We're going to finalize it on the show, on the gaze. Everybody. I mean, do you want the history or just the, Give everything the everything? So everybody's just like, okay. Okay, so we were, you know, 13, 14-year-old kids in Alabama starting a band. Had to come up with a name. Um, there were sort of two ideas that we, I don't know, whatever. Anyways, the deal is we wanted something that we knew no other band would already have and that we wouldn't have to, like, go on tour and go to L.A. and someone's like, oh, Jimmy and the Smiths, like, already exist, you know? what? <laughs> and then, uh, and we also wanted something that we wouldn't regret choosing, like something that a 13-year-old would think is funny or a 13-year-old would think is like, yeah, you know. So, so having that in mind, I slept on it and just woke up and the combination of letters was there and that was it. Wow. But the, 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 the problem lies and we didn't know X's were symbolic of so many different things. That's, that's where the problem, like right. porn, three X's, like... Right. Like, oh, like we played uh, Louisiana, and all these people were like, are you guys like a Baton Rouge straight edge band? And we were like, what the fuck, you know? Like, <laughs> Check it out, Wars, XBXRX. Thank you guys for playing the show and playing shows and making music and creating. Gaze. Yeah, you're watching The Gaze. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>